Hi everyone, this is a quick bird's eye view of everything that we learned in lessons 10 through 16. So you've learned a lot and let's just summarize it with this information here. So you know how to say yo trabajo, I work. You could say things like uh, trabajo hoy, I work today, trabajo mañana, I work tomorrow, trabajo todo el día, I work every day. Uh, you can also say tu trabajas, which means you work. That's the informal you addressing one person that you know well. So I can say trabajas hoy, you work today, trabajas mañana, and so forth and so on. You can say usted trabaja, you work. This is the formal you. You're addressing one person. So usted trabaja hoy, you work today. Usted trabaja mañana, you work tomorrow. He works, él trabaja. Él trabaja hoy, él trabaja mañana. She works, ella trabaja, ella trabaja hoy, ella trabaja mañana, ella trabaja este fin de semana, she works this weekend, she works too much, ella trabaja demasiado, nosotros trabajamos, or simply trabajamos, we work, trabajamos hoy, we work today, we work tomorrow, trabajamos mañana, we work too much, trabajamos demasiado, we always work, trabajamos siempre, you work, this is the informal you, plural, addressing more than one person, and it's used in Spain. So vosotros trabajáis, trabajáis, or simply trabajáis. So I could say, you work all day, trabajáis todo el día, you work this weekend, trabajáis este fin de semana. You work, this is the plural you, and this can be formal or informal in Latin America, or simply formal in Spain. Ustedes trabajan, so you work tomorrow, ustedes trabajan mañana, you work today, ustedes trabajan hoy, you work too much, ustedes trabajan demasiado. They work, ellos or ellas, uh, they work today, ellos trabajan hoy, they work a little bit, ellos trabajan un poco, ellos trabajan siempre, they always work. So you can, you've really learned how to say a lot. With just the information that you see on this screen, if you know, if you've memorized, if you've learned all this information, you can generate many thoughts, many ideas just with this information. Okay, so let's move on. I just want to point out uh, the endings of the verb. If you take a look here, notice that the endings are different in all of these quadrants here. So the endings are very important. Uh, we'll talk about this more in a future lesson, but for now just be aware that these are what we call the AR verb endings. Any infinitive that ends in AR, if it's what's considered a regular infinitive, when you conjugate it, these are the forms that you use. So what this means is if you memorize this piece of information that O goes with yo and AS goes with tu and the rest of it, if you memorize all of that, what this means is you can literally conjugate the majority of Spanish verbs in the present tense because the majority of verbs are AR verbs. So aside from the statements that you can make, just one more thing as we finish up here. Remember that you can also ask questions. All you have to do is reverse the verb and subject word order. So verb first and then subject. So to ask the question, do I work? You would say trabajo yo. We would normally leave out the yo, so it's just trabajo. Now combining it with some of the elements that we have over here, you can say things like, uh, do I work today, trabajo hoy, do I work tomorrow, trabajo mañana, do I work this weekend, trabajo este fin de semana, do you work, trabajas, do you work tomorrow, trabajas mañana, the formal you, do you work, trabaja usted, do you work this weekend? Trabaja usted este fin de semana? Trabaja él? Does he work? Does he work every day? Trabaja él todos los días? Does she work this weekend? Trabaja ella este fin de semana? Do we work all day long? Trabajamos todo el día? Do you work de vosotros? Uh, do you work tomorrow? Trabajáis mañana? The other plural you, that's ustedes, and that can be in Spain, that can be formal or informal in Latin America, or just formal in Spain. So if I want to ask the question, do you work this weekend? 
trabajan ustedes este fin de semana? Uh, ellos o ellas, they, do they work? Trabajan ellos, uh, do they work too much? Trabajan ellos demasiado? Uh, do they work tomorrow? Just the ellas, trabajan ellas mañana. Okay, so you can see you've learned a lot in these last few lessons. All right, so to continue advancing your knowledge, join us for the next lesson by clicking on the video that appears here on your screen.